Hey, what's up, Doc and fam, and welcome back to Oh the Herd Manity. As you know, the Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta banners, the uh, the 400 hours only is ending really soon. I got about 54 hours remaining here, and I have 347 stones, which means I can do one more round on each banner before they go away and take advantage of that increased Spirit Bomb luck that you guys saw in the last couple videos. So, if you have one more chance to hit these banners, whether it's singles or multis, and you want to do some team pulls, team hermination, whip out your phone, because we're going to hit the Goku banner now, and in the next video, we're hitting the Vegeta banner. So, make sure that notification bell is clicked, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's get started and get ourselves an L.I. Goku Dupe! I'm ready for it. I hope you are too. All right. Here we go. So this banner, I mean, the only the only unit I haven't pulled off of here is Lord Slug, which would be really great because I don't have him. And I just rainbowed Transforming Goku. I just rainbowed in Frieza. And I don't need any uh, Vegitos here, okay? So, we're basically going for LR Goku dupes or our first copy of Lord Slug. Probably the only Dokken tuber right now who's like, yeah, let's go Lord Slug, we need you, bro. But hey, man, you gotta, you gotta have them all. And as soon as I get them, I got nine tech Lord Slugs ready to go. All right, so we're starting out with uh, Gohan riding Icarus. So he'll be going immediately uh, to the Baba shop. <laughs> it's just the way it is. Oh, nice. Vegeta and Chouchou. Oh, we got a Patora Awarida. This could be our first ally Goku dupe. Here we go. All right, I don't even care. The Dodoria showed up. Ah, this is it. I just rainbowed him. He's the Awari Da, but we can still pull more SSIs. Come on. Oh man, it it sucks to not get excited about pulling a transforming Goku because he's such a good unit. Come on. I know you're hiding. There's one more SSI hiding in here. Oh, wow. Okay. I think that's my first dupe of Janambu. Well, at least at least it's useful and it's one that I need, right? It's all that matters as long as we get useful SSIs. And I'm actually building another dupe of my transforming Goku. Because with units like that, what I like to do when I do hidden potential is I always max out the crit. So for some units, I want to try maxing out the um, the additional attack and just kind of see how they both play, you know? Because I'm still convinced that maxing out crit is the way to go always, especially how I play. I like to play like very aggressively and attack all the time. So I'm not so much worried about additionals. I'm just worried about beefing up my team with as much attack power as possible so I can just snipe out of the gate. Come on, man, let's go, Lord Slug. Oh, Android 21, I just rainbowed her, but hey, I'll increase her super attack for free. I haven't touched her super attack yet because I haven't needed to use her yet, really. So, boosting the super attack is always good. Wow, and Awari duh, was that, was that Piccolo and Gohan? All right, that's different. Can we go God though? Ah, close. Super Saiyan 3. And we got a friggin' Angel Frieza who I just rainbowed. Oh man, we're pulling such good units! If I didn't have a rainbow, it would be so fire! Took me forever to pull copies of friggin' Golden Frieza, and now I'm pulling Go Golden Frieza and Transforming Goku left and right. We still got tickets though. We could get an LR Goku. Troll Han. Gosh darn it. <laughs> All right. Now we're going to go collect our tickets. Here we go. Dude, I think I actually, I finally hit the threshold. Yeah, 519 coins. 
Saving those babies for when Broly comes, okay? That's what I'm gonna be spending my coins on. All right, let's go down to those tickets. All right, we got nine shots. My buddy Luck just pulled LR Vegeta on tickets. And that's actually where I pulled my LR Vegeta too. All right, here we go, nine chances. As long as we pull at least one SSI, it's worth it. Nope, Zab on. Go again. Come on! Damn, it could have been a TN. Trunks had to take his place. Oh, come on! Come on! Well, I'll use him to boost the super attack of my Android 16. That's okay. The tech Android 16. Okay, this looks promising. Rainbow release. Ah, only a Super Saiyan 1, come on. Oh, okay, so there's at least that one SSI. Is this the one that, is this the EZA one? Yeah. Well, I have another Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta that I can use to boost the super attack, so. Won't go completely to waste. All right, base form, Kamehameha. Could get a screen break out of this. Come on. Nope. Tien came out to pull a Tien. <laughs> All right, five more chances, guys. Here we go. Get those phones out. Let's summon together. Come on, come on. Android 18. I've actually been keeping uh, those Android 18s, using her to boost the super attack. Just like, there's a bunch of other Android 18s that you can actually use her for a 50% chance increase in the super attack. So it's definitely worth it. It doesn't cost that much to go from SI to SSI. It's SSI to you are above that takes a big hit on your Zenny and your training items. And also your awakening medals. Three chances, I would like to just open one path for LR Goku, just one. I'm not gonna be greedy. I'm not gonna be greedy, just one path, that bottom right path. Give me a few additionals and crits, that's all I want. Two more shots, it's coming down to the wire guys, it's coming down to the wire here. Oh, that was late. I thought it was going to be a solo Goku. Base form, Gohan and Yamcha. I've never seen them come out side by side like that before. That was a first for me. All right, guys, here we go. The final summon on the LM Goku banner. Can we get a win? Can we get a win? Get out your phones. If you've been waiting until the last summon to summon with me, Get your phones out. Let's hit it right now. Group summon. Got a solo trunks. Three, two, one. Hit it. Okay. Ah, oh, there was hang time there. Ah, we're ending with a Super Saiyan 2 Goku. But guys, overall, overall, I mean, the banner, the banner was still pretty hype. I mean, take a look at this. We got a transforming Goku and uh, an Int Golden Frieza in an Android 21. Like, that's pretty freaking good for 150 stones. I'm actually really happy with this. Granted, they're both rainbowed, but at least now, if I want to, I can have another Resurrected Warriors lead if I'm doing Super Battle Road, which could come in handy. And like I said, if I want to take this Goku, as you can see, I already started one right here. He's already locked. I have now one path open for my second transforming Goku. And the other one is rainbowed. Let me show you guys. I just recently rainbowed him. Here he is right here. So I already have him done and I maxed out his crits, as you can see. Crits are 15. So I'm gonna try building another one 
and then getting his additional damage up. And then maybe do a comparison because a lot of people like to do additionals more than crits. I like doing crits more than additionals. Could be cool to finally get two units side by side and see who does the most damage output. So be on the lookout for that. And yes, next up, we are going to the Vegeta banner and we're gonna drop 150 stones and see if we can pull that Vegeta do. So if you haven't already, be sure to tap that like button and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next video. I'll see you guys next time.